the ACL injury of the knee due to high impact movements rarely happens unnoticed. At the exact moment of the injury, a popping sound might be heard and your knee may limp soon after. If you suspect this is an ACL injury, put your leg above the heart and put ice on it. Do not use it to do any activity and directly see your doctor to get a complete observation, especially if a bluish area appears or your feet become cold, which means that the blood vessels to your knee is injured. Within 24 hours, your knee will swell and become painful. The knee will lose a wide range of movement. Tenderness along the joint line and discomfort while walking are expected. The swelling and pain eventually resolve on their own, but is still unsafe for use in sports activity, which can risk further damage to the meniscus on the knee. Diagnosis The doctor will ask about how your knee can become damaged. Physical examination and comparison with a healthy knee can help. The Lachman test will determine whether your ACL is still intact or not. Special tests can also show that other ligaments are still in their place. X-ray imaging helps to show if any damage to the bone is visible. MRI creates better images for soft tissue, such as the ACL. Non-surgical treatment. For lower grade or partial injuries on the ACL, or when the knee is still stable, this treatment is favorable. Especially in children, a surgery may damage their bone growth plate. People with previous physiological problems in their knee should also opt for non-surgical treatment because the surgery may carry more risks. The non-surgical treatments include using a brace to protect and stabilize your knee. Crutches are needed for a while to prevent your knees from bearing too much weight. Physical therapy can start as soon as the swelling of the knee goes away to promptly restore your knee's function and strengthen the leg's muscles. But the damaged ACL disables your knee from returning to its former condition and swift movements. To support an active lifestyle like football athletes, the damaged ACL needs to be reconstructed to prevent joint instability, further injury to other parts, or osteoarthritis in the future. Our next part of this video will discuss it.